Hello my beautiful MK Love fam and welcome back to another episode. If you are new and this is your first time watching any of my videos, my name is Mel. I make videos to help you learn to love yourself, trust your intuition, and manifest your desires. Today I want to speak about Mercury Retrograde because we're currently in this energy until the 15th or the 16th of April, depending on where you are in the world. Now, if you are new to this beautiful spiritual realm and people are talking about Mercury retrograde and you're like, what the flip does that mean? Mercury basically is a planet that is in charge of communication, electronics and travel. Now, I used to be very fearful of this time, but I've actually really grown to love it. When I was just learning about the different phases of the moon and astrology and planets and why things do certain things, you know, I was a little bit like skeptical. There was a couple of things that happened to me, like I've had during a Mercury retrograde, I've had like my um, Mac charger, it just stopped working one day. I took it into Apple and they were like, oh, it looks brand new. I don't know what happened. I was like, oh, Mercury's in retrograde. And they were like, huh? Um, I was like, oh, it's all good. Um, I've had my Nutribullet play up during Mercury retrograde. I've had filming has been a lot difficult during Mercury retrograde. I, was I just filmed a client's private reading just before and the my camera overheated twice. And I was like, oh my God. But you know, there's three things I want to teach you about Mercury retrograde and three reasons why I love Mercury retrograde so much. Are you ready for this? Na, 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 na. Okay. Let me just consult my notes. Oh yeah, the first one is that Mercury retrograde basically highlights to you things that you haven't seen. Maybe you have been like um, work, 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 like you're moving super duper fast. Um, and Mercury retrograde gives you an opportunity to slow down and to see things that you haven't seen before. And I, I think it's a really beautiful time. And anytime I hear any planets go retrograde, I'm like, oh, this is beautiful. This is gonna teach me something that I wouldn't have seen if it wasn't in retrograde. Um, so it's very interesting for me in my business the other day, I'm not too sure if you guys follow me on Instagram, but I highly recommend that you do. I did a live yesterday on Instagram when I was telling my beautiful MK Love fam over there that um, Mercury Retrograde highlighted to me an area in which I my business is going to change. It's kind of like a massive leap of faith and totally out of my comfort zone. And I was like, oh my God, I could totally do that. So I somehow saw this dude's webinar and I've seen his webinar come up before, but for some reason, I decided to click on his webinar the other night and just before I was about to go to bed, I'm like, oh yeah, it'll probably be tomorrow. He's like, the webinar is starting in three minutes. And I was like, oh my goodness. And so um, I watched it, stayed up to like midnight watching it. I was so hooked. I was like, oh my God, all these thoughts were running through my head and I was like, Oh my God, I never thought I could do that. I'm like, yes, I can do that. Like, um, I'm unstoppable. I am where I am and it's okay. Everything is working out for me. It was just like a different layer of possibilities that I hadn't seen before. Cause I kind of got like tunneled vision and I'm like, this is where I'm going. But I'm like, you know, like, oh, and then I heard that song, the winner takes it all. Like that's, that's the direction that I'm heading, like in a winning direction. So I think it's really, really beautiful. The other thing is, oh yeah, during Mercury Retrograde, it actually takes you, this is tip number two, by the way, it actually it actually trains you to work a little bit harder. Because things are going retrograde, it just means that it's just moving a lot slower, which means you need to work three times as hard to get the results as you normally would if it wasn't in retrograde. But what's really, really beautiful about tip number two is that when you, the Mercury goes out of retrograde, you're gonna get more results. It's kind of like an, an even more powerful time. Like whatever you're working in during retrograde, it's gonna give you three times more the results when Mercury goes out of retrograde. Isn't that interesting? And my third tip is that Mercury retrograde teaches you patience. It teaches you not to like freak out when like when the camera overheats and you're just like, okay, I breathe in and I breathe out. Everything's working out for me. It's like, what, instead of saying, why is this happening? Just say, what is the universe trying to teach me during this time? So then my three tips, I hope it helps you during this beautiful time. Comment below and let me know my loves, 
what has come up for you during Mercury retrograde? Has it highlighted a different area that you haven't like seen before? I just saw a flash of like a car with like a, a cover on it and then it's like pulling the cover off. It's like, ta-da, have you thought of this? And you're like, ah, uh, no. Um, yeah, has anything gone wrong? I've had friends where their phones have like stopped working out of nowhere. Someone who has like dropped their phone in the toilet where normally they're super careful, but oh, it's just, Craziness happens, but it's a really beautiful time. So don't see Mercury retrograde as something you need to be scared of. If you're catching flights or you've got a holiday booked, um, maybe just have a, a backup plan. Um, yeah, because I'm actually going away during Mercury retrograde, which is the weekend of my birthday, which is in the balsamic moon, which is like in a couple of weeks. How crazy is that? I get to see my mom up there and there's a bath in the Airbnb that I'm going to. I'm so excited. Da, 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 da. Anyways, my love, I'm in such a good mood. I just filmed the best private reading for a client. She had such good energy and I was like, I haven't made a video for the vlog tomorrow. So I was like, all right, I'll tell you about Mercury Retrograde because it's really beautiful. It's such a beautiful time. So yeah, let, let me know in the comments what has come up for you. Has it taken you in a different direction or if some crazy stuff is going on, I want to hear about it because we can all laugh about it because in the moment we get like, I remember my computer would always fill up, like my hard drive would fill up um, every re retrograde and then I found a video to help clear that other file. Oh my God, this dude's video just saved my life and I found like 250 gig worth of stuff that was in a folder that I thought I had deleted, but it was saved in somewhere else and blah, blah, blah. Anyway, it's a beautiful time. Thank you so much for watching this video. I totally appreciate you more than you ever know. And I hope that you are having an amazing week. If you're struggling, check out my weekly angel guidance. It's gonna make you feel like you're not going crazy. And yes, the energies of the planets are changing. We're preparing for Sunday, which is our full moon in Libra. And um, I just want to send you some love and let you know that I'm thinking of you. And yeah, I have so many calls to action, like follow me on Instagram, subscribe if you haven't already, turn on the bell because that's going to notify you every single time I have a video. Otherwise you won't know. And yeah, have an amazing day wherever you're on the world. And my loves, I will see you on Sunday for another weekly angel guidance. I love you. Enjoy Mercury Retrograde. Bye.